<laughs> Hi guys, I'm Ina Back Iverson with the Red Carpet Report and today we are at the Motion Picture Academy where they are celebrating the Oscar nominated animated features. Hi! Hi. We're from Red Carpet Report. Oh my gosh. I actually met you guys at the yeah. Golden Globes for TV2 yes. Norway. Oh okay. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So, because you guys went Hello to everybody in Norway, yeah. right? <laughs> Our fans. And you were kind of inspired by Norway for this one. Definitely. Absolutely. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Well, Bonnie had a great idea. We should take a, a research trip this time around. And so we planned to go to Norway. We we went to museums in Oslo. Uh, we took boat trips down the fjords, around, around Bergen. And, um, and then a smaller group of us went north to Svalbard for a kind of six-day snowmobile safari, just taking photos of the light and seeing these incredible pristine glaciers and fjords and co completely untouched by man. It was yeah. really wonderful. What was the biggest challenge for you guys putting this whole film together? I mean, you know, listen, I think it's, all, it's always a challenge to try to tell a good story within the parameters of, uh, a, you know, a schedule and some deadlines and a budget. but. You know, um, uh, you just want to make the, you try to make the best story, tell the best story that you can. But Dean made it easy because he wrote a great script. So that made it, that made the challenges fun for us, I think. And I have to ask you though, is it possible that it could be a female dragon tamer in the future? I'm sorry, can, can you repeat it one more time? A female dragon tamer, will that be something we can see in the future? A theme? Female. Oh. Well, you have Astrid is in there. She's sort of our she, Astrid and, yeah. and Roughnut. They're kind of our they're the tough women of uh, Burke and, and, and Volka. And Vol Volka's uh, she's a natural, you know, because she's lived with the dragons for twenty years. So yeah. she has she has a lot to teach uh, Hiccup and, and the other Vikings of Burke. Yeah. I, I think it's quite um, it's quite exciting to think about where we can go with all of these characters in the third part. Yeah. Last question. The big night is on Sunday. Have you guys prepared a speech, or is that something you don't do? Well, they tell you when you when you uh, get nominated that you must prepare something. Yeah. So uh, we don't know if that's you know we don't you don't want to go too far because you want to you know if, if you want it to be a bit bit of a surprise. But I think in your mind you have to kind of be ready just in case it happens. Yeah. yeah. I'm superstitious. I don't want to think about it too much. But I, th I think it helps to know that if you are lucky enough to get called up there, that there, there are certain people we need to thank, and that, that kind of gives the overwhelming moment some structure. Yeah. But, uh, but, you know, if, if we should be so lucky. <laughs> we hope so. Good luck. Oh, thank, thank you, you. So, much. so much. Thank you. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to show your love by sharing this video and hitting the like button. And also don't forget to subscribe to our channel. I want to know what's your favorite animated movie, so leave me a comment on the comment box below.